My name is Kat Kavari. I play Ms. Marvel, a.k.a. Kamala Khan, and I'm here to say I'm Biggin! Now, I'm excited to see Ms. Marvel finally on the big screen. Yes. And we will be on the big screen today. Yes. Are you, are you excited to see this? I am so excited to see this. This has been such a long time coming. I mean, we recorded this last year, so, and it's just been building up until this very moment, so I'm super excited. Now, do you know what, did you know what your character looked like like before you started recording her voice? Um, yeah, I mean, I, I had, rec so I had, before Marvel Rising, I had done uh, Avengers Assemble. Yes, that's right. So I did, I, I was familiar with Kamala for, for a while before that. Okay. Before that, I can't remember if I did. I think I, I think I did look her up at some point. Okay. I think I had Googled her. I had known about her. I had, I had heard of her before I'd even auditioned for her. Okay. But I can't remember if I knew exactly what she looked like. Because in the series, it seems like she's modeled after you. And I'm just wondering how that made you feel. Um, amazing. Just because everything that ever pops up with her, I'm just like, oh my god, that's like me. Oh my gosh, that's like me. It's just that that keeps happening. Is that I, I there there are so many different ways that I relate to her. There's so many different levels. I mean, her love for her hometown, Jersey City. Like oh. that's I'm not, but Oakland. I have like a huge love for my town, and the way that she's just so protective of it reminds me of myself. It just. How she is with her family reminds me of myself. You know, she's she had always wanted to be a superhero. I had always wanted to be an actor, and then when it finally happened, she was geeking out. I'm geeking out constantly just from being able to do this. So I, I, I love Kamala. That's awesome. And have you seen these Hasbro character figures? Yes, I have. They're incredible. Like, what do you hope like little girls get from this? Amazing. I mean, I just hope I did not have any female superheroes growing up. Mm -hmm. I did not know that was a possibility, so a lot of who I looked up to were male superheroes. Yeah, which ones? I'm curious. Um, well, they, <laughs> my male superheroes ended up being like, it, it was a lot of, you know, I loved Spider-Man. Okay. I actually was, I had, I was a climber, so I loved to like climb things and I would get injured a lot. Um, that was a common occurrence for me. <laughs> it didn't stop me from climbing, but I, that was something that I like always wanted to do. I just really liked that power a lot. Um, and then just like growing up, I, I was a big Seinfeld head, and okay. so Seinfeld was... Yeah. He's Although not Julia, not you know. a superhero, but Julia Louis-Dreyfus is my superhero. Oh, there you go. <laughs> um, Perfect. So a little different, a different kind of superhero. Okay. Um, well, what so do you yeah, I like hope that today will get from this series. I really hope girls today are, are going to see a lot of themselves in these superheroes, see a lot of their own relationships and friendships reflected in this, oh, and important. feel like included in in ways that I never necessarily felt included, and also this focus that this movie in particular has on the, the greater good. You know, their goal is to make sure that they understand one another, that especially Kamala, she wants to make sure that they get to know each other on an individual basis and not make these blanketed judgments about one another. And so I think that idea of don't make judgments about people based on, you know, what you might think they represent, yeah. but but try to get some to know someone on an individual one-on-one -on -one basis. And I really hope kids get get that message because I think it's important, especially for you know bullying and, and any other kind of toxic environment that that kids go through. Definitely. Do you have any particular story, like any little girls coming up to you, or, or just uh, like you being a role model for them? Um, I I've had some very sweet encounters with with younger fans at, at the Comic-Con, okay. and that's just been super sweet because they they seem so genuinely excited to, to have a female superhero, and this one little girl made me a, a little bracelet with the Kamala Khan uh, colors, uh, so that's, that's always nice. It's very heartwarming to have a, a young fan. Definitely. Yeah. Skywalking!